Stokes by making a little bit of running early in the game, and there's Powell, but inside Bright shoots into the side. Pit. Good turn by Matthews, lobs it just over the crossbar. Good chance at both ends then. Taken by Fitzgerald and Matthews and inside right. He's coming in on the goalkeeper and it's saved by Hartop's right foot. This corner taken short. Succession for the visitors. Not even to Messi Sunday. Back out to Higgins. In comes the right foot cross, and that's it. Twenty feet to the corner. Good start. The blind. His third corner from the right hand side. And it comes. It goes all the way through. It's a clear by. Chester's again a bit of a deflection and the ball comes out to Higgins Pugsley again right foot cross headed clear yet again by Rangers and it was Powell who got his clearance in there getting the ball inside to Ozzy Sunday and he's off and running overcomes the uh, cross and it's Ritson who manages to deflect it away for yet another corner on the right and another right side corner for the visitors this time one of course by Ezzy Sunday there's the header down, and that's turned away by Hartop. And it was Froggart's header on that occasion. Still, the visitors have the ball well on top at the moment. In comes the cross again, and Ritson slices it away for another corner. Bugsley again. Right side corner. And it comes, missed this time by a yellow shirt. Break on. The ball is played out to the right-hand side. Now, what can the home side produce on the break? Defence has got back now, and the tackle is, is done, and the ball flies. Goodness me, off Powell's foot and goes wide. Another right side throw for Rangers. Under a little bit of pressure from those earlier corners, Hartop made a couple of saves. That's a good long throw, headed on by Powell. There's a chance, maybe, but hooked away by visitors. I think it was Higgins Pugsley who got his foot to the ball. That's well won by Fitzgerald. Chester's getting the ball away, but not too far. Kondo collects it, good pace, partially tackled by Regan. Fitzgerald clips the ball towards Matthews. And he gets past Chester's. There's got to be a chance, surely, and the ball is kicked away from the goal line. And again, Rangers escape. Powell gets the ball out to the left-hand side. And the break is on for Rangers this time. Archer goes on the outside towards the byline, and his cross is too hard. OK, we've got a right-side free kick now for Rangers. Which turn will curl in with his left foot. Ritson got a foot to that, and uh, free kick offside. I think it's offside according to the flag which is waving on the far side. And he's got there before Turnbull. He's got past the defender. Just now laid for Ezzy Sunday. Another chance for the visitors. Missed. So Higgins, Pugsley on the right hand side here to take the free kick. Just a couple of yards in from the corner flag. This flight was a header at the far post. Hartop's down and Hartop grabs it. Following from its downward header. And Rangers escape again as the ball long. And that's a very good ball. There's a chance now for the visitors. Parsons is tackled by Hassan. Visitors still have the ball. Higgins, Pugsley picks it up. He'll try a shot. Just over the bar, but well worth an effort from that distance. Kondo really battling for the ball, and then almost fouled, and there's a shot from distance by Fitzgerald. He catches Gerald, puts the ball through the middle, and Essie Sunday has lifted it over the keeper, and 
it's 1-0 to the visitors and just about deserved, I think. Turnbull, use Wassel, and Turnbull makes the run down the left hand side, opening up space for Wassel, who will go towards the right under Archer. Hassan making the overlap, ball comes inside to Wassel, pokes it, and goalkeeper rushes out with an Archer's feet. It's a low one towards the near post. Back flicked inside, and there is Higgins, Pugsley. His shot is blocked, and the hosts escape. Out to Archer. Little run by Blythe. It's poked through towards Archer. Archer doesn't really do anything with it. if he can get it in from an angle and the goalkeeper saves it with his feet Parsons tries to get in on that but Regan battles very hard to get it away for the hosts and still he has it his pass is intercepted somewhat and that's well played by Ladilla Fitzgerald plays it through to Ezzy Sunday and he puts the ball in the net and he's going to get a caution for that Plays the ball left footed towards Ezzy Sunday. Made clear by Chesters. Fitzgerald though gets in the cross. Ritson can only help it on towards Parsons. Parsons' shot is deflected by Hassan. And Rangers survive that one. Out to the left hand side it goes to Dunley. Foul gets the ball down the line, but Dunkley's he's got it in, and goodness me, it's in the net from Cuts. A good run and chase by Dunkley, but goodness me, well, it's one. So, a couple of uh, substitutions made by the visitors. Edwards and Sonogo have come on. Free kick to the hosts from that left flank. Following the foul and caution for Condo. Nasty ball. Goalkeeper does well to catch it. Powell heads the ball on. Laid off. Chance for Dunkley. Across comes the ball, but goalkeeper's down before Dumbleton could get in. And uh, the ball comes out to Stenson. Long pass, and that's Addo. The left side corner will come in from Turner. So it'll be his left foot towards the far post. Powell is there, but he's gone under it and headed it too high. Come Rangers again. It's Turnbull's cross. Blocked this time. Cuts takes it. Still has it. Cuts it into the far post. And there's a little alarm. Oh dear. Turner's lifted it. Dunkley on that left flank. Plays it in again. It's got a good chance, but well done. Dives onto the ball. Similar to the way they always scored that time, Cook. And, uh, the visitors need to 
get themselves going again. Missing, I think, the, the general in midfield, Fitzgerald. Ali, who's been starved of possession since he came on. He's across. Oh, and it's just in front of Ezzy Sunday. Still they have an opportunity. Ali's coming in towards the far post. And it is a corner off Tristus. We've got this right side corner now for United. There's a flying effort at goal. Cook tries a shot. Cook lays it off. There's a, it's kicked off the line by Ritson. And Chester's hammers it clear. What a chance for the visitors. Mills. Now what can the visitors do? Second phase of attack. Out it goes to that right-hand side. Oh, that's a good tackle by Turnbull. On it. Goes out to the left-hand side. Now then, what can the side produce? In comes the cross. There's a header! And it's in from Powell. A glancing header. And it's 2-1 to Rangers. Now then, what have uh, Birmingham United got? That was after the corner was so easily cleared. Dunkley then a remarkable cross, and Powell used that leap that he has to glance the ball past Rush into the corner of the net. And you wouldn't have guessed that this might be the scoreline after the way the first half panned out. Birmingham United had played so strongly and missed a, a good number of chances. Well, let's see what happens in these final five minutes or so. Does he need something from somewhere? There's the chance, there's the shot, and that's over the crossbar. And a decent attempt from the skipper. Cuts, wasting a bit of time. The ball comes towards Regan. It's cleared by Lewis. And there is the final whistle. And Coventry Rangers have come back to beat Birmingham United by two goals to one, and it uh, certainly came as a bit of a surprise at the time.